Hello, welcome back to Reacts. So we're going to watch in season ten, episode eleven of Walking Dead, and this one's called Morning Star. So yeah, last episode, Ada went on Michael Myers <laughs> on Alexandria, and it's just like oh, because I mean, you can tell that you can tell that Gabriel is is grieving for Sadiq, and his is turning into anger, especially with what he did to, to Dante and his want to you know get out there and deal with it but unfortunately he left Alexandria with not that many people to fight off Beta when he arrived and started killing people and creating a little walker herd in Alexandria and it's like oh although one of the guys that died was one of the ones that messed with Lydia so I'm not that sorry for him. <laughs> we also got a cool fight between Daryl and Alpha which unfortunately he didn't manage to kill her and then Lydia didn't manage to kill her and then she got rescued and now she's all, oh I'm stronger than ever. So that's super annoying. <laughs> but yeah, enough chatting. Let's get into it, shall we? What's it collecting? Is she gonna make him do it? Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm in Virginia. Oh. Yeah, just very much luck to meet you. Oh. I really like to meet you too. Okay, I'll talk to my people. Ooh, they created some. All right, I'll just sit here with you, and we'll get eaten by mosquitoes together. <laughs> Giant Whisperer took a swipe at me, but I'm fine, thanks. W what's up your butt? She trusted me to keep our chats mono and mono and you. Yeah. I don't like this ominous okay. music <laughs> as they load up the kid. Oh, okay. Okay, come on. <laughs> oh, is she wearing, is RJ wearing his jacket in her hat? That's so cute. Suspicious looking log in the middle of the way. Feels like a real Negan club. It's Negan. It's her now. Oh, is she gonna see it? I wanted to tell you. You almost did a couple of times, but chickened out. Oh. Hey, where are you thinking about? I hate it too. What's going on here? I hate his. Here. Every time he does this type of stuff, I hate it. Shut I think, up. shut up, previous Ricky yeah, and Xavier. Pearl's a better father than mine was. Oh my god, there's a fly in here. Oh. Do you want to kiss me? <laughs> Come on, kiss me. Special kind of peculiar to hanker for a kiss from someone you've never met, isn't it? Wow. I know. <laughs> this is not the time to be mulling matters of a forlorn heart. See, did I say they'd become besties again? Aww. <laughs> you hate me, man. I won't be thinking about you. You feel lonely. Mm. Never thought these two would have a conversation like this. <laughs> oh, Gross. are they here? Yeah. Let's run together up. I'm not ready. 
Have you heard what they said on the news today? Have you heard <laughs> what is, is coming to us all? He could feel tension in the oh, atmosphere. Oh, 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 keep thinking the fire's gonna touch me. <sighs> he would look in the mirror, see an old it's him. Doesn't matter, Aww. they survive somehow. They said there's nothing can be done about the situation. Well, yes. She's his bestie. Barry. She is my proverbial BFF. <laughs> and... Yes. I love it. Have a look. He looks good. That was so sweet. I'm never gonna hate you. Hated her for a little bit, but it is Carol's film. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a lot of walkers! <laughs> oh, I really wish they would have dig some ditches! See it, George, kill it. Yes, yeah, so that was season 10, episode 11 of The Walking Dead. I have to say, all these years that Hilltop's been around, they have not done as much fortification as I would have hoped, which, you know, we should have had these massive ditches with like spikes in the bottom and people should have been on the walls throwing shit. <laughs> I thought they still had some guns around, but I'm, I'm thinking no, they must just all be obsolete by now maybe, to have the amount they need, and the bullets they need. But I don't know, I feel like this war has been coming and they are underprepared and I'm really annoyed. <laughs> but I suppose if they were too prepared it wouldn't propel the story, it would have just like halted it here really wouldn't it? So. <laughs> But I did enjoy the lead up to the fight and all the character development we got and interactions and kind of a little bit more about Carol's grief because while she is isolating herself, you know, people are avoiding her as well so she's 
feeling that loneliness and like Lydia said no one's really kind of having honest conversations anymore <laughs> but I did like Ezekiel and Carol getting together for a bit I don't know if this is them officially back together probably isn't but you know how much I love those two so <laughs> I just need Connie to come back and her and Daryl to live happily ever after but but now I'm worried for the kids because they're all trapped in the big house with barely any adults and I'm like shit <laughs> So full length and early access available on patreon.com or slash Sarah Reacts and I'll see you next time.